wh while I was in New York, I went to, uh, went to the planetarium, which was a bewildering experience. Bewildering because I got to go on a tour of space. There's this big, massive, huge golf ball of a kind of a dome thing, and it's filled with seats every which way, and from halfway up all the way around is this magical, bendy cinema screen. And you go on this tour of space, and it starts off in knock. <laughs> <laughs> it, starts off, it, it, it starts off, and you see the world. And the world, I don't know you know this already, but the world is so beautiful when you look. It's, it's, it's just this blue spinning ball with no strings, and it's our house. <laughs> and it's just lovely, and it's just... Always moving, even when you're fast asleep. You think you're still, you're not. <laughs> you're on a big ball going... <laughs> and then we got to look at all the other planets in our solar system. And compared to them, we're singing, because they're all, they're all covered in dust and bricks and just ugly stuff and nothing, really. They don't have rabbits. <laughs> they don't have trees and they certainly don't have children. <laughs> so then we got to look at all the other solar systems that exist in our galaxy, right? And there's hundreds of them. Hundreds and thousands of solar systems with suns that would dwarf ours. Our sun would just be a phlegm on your brother's jacket. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember when you used to do that? You spent four years in seconds going... <laughs> <laughs> so there's, you know, and, and there's planets much bigger. There's planets with 19 moons. 19 moons. You'd never get a wink of sleep. <laughs> like sleeping under floodlights, you know. And <laughs> then we got to look, right, at all the other galaxies that exist in our universe. And... There's millions of them! <laughs> Vaster and more expansive than our one. Then... I mean, I'm in tears now at this stage. Then we get to look at all the other universes, apart from our one, and there's millions of them! <laughs> then we get to look at all the other universes that we don't know about, but that we know about. <laughs> And the rest then was just space. And I came to the conclusion that far from being the centre of things, far from being important, far from being even relevant, nobody knows we're here. <laughs> so let's wreck the joint. <laughs> Nobody knows we're here. Nobody knows why we're here. Nobody knows how we're here. If everybody who had ever lived ever was able to stand up at the same time and say the word hello in the same language, nobody would hear us. This is it, folks. This is life. It's just me and you and the rabbits and the trees and the children. That's all. <laughs> so, what do you think of it? <laughs> it's not always great, is it, life? It's stressful everywhere. Noise and... People are so overrated, aren't they? <laughs> There's nothing... They say life is short, and the wrong company can let it do long. 